first YouTube video. Now, I know, I know you're getting super mad at me probably because of the title, but let me explain. Um, today we're going to be making a video on a person known as uh, Daniel Buddhist Man. And if I'm being honest, this is probably the funniest person that I've ever, <laughs> I've ever fucking seen. Wait. What? Hi guys, just with the world here. Today we're going to be responding to a YouTuber known as JFix and his opinions about Daniel Foodisman. Now, if you don't know who Daniel Foodisman is, he was a YouTuber, or is a YouTuber who exploits deaths and other tragedies and makes really cringy 3am videos and quite disgusting things. He's uh, exploited Jacksepticeye's dad who died sadly. He made videos on him saying why he deserved to die and stuff. He made videos on Betty White. He made videos on uh, the Astro World thing that happened. Honestly, this man has issues, to say the least. He had a Discord server where homophobic uh, and racist things were shared. He's been caught saying the N-word multiple times he honestly it's disgusting and i disagree with what jfx is saying in this video so that's what we're talking about today before we continue on with this video i just want to say everyone who is watching this please do not do not go out and harass anybody mentioned in this video even the person who i am responding to even if you disagree with them that's no need to go out and harass them leave disgusting comments and you know, do any of that. Do not do any of that. Okay? Right. Let's get into today's video. On YouTube, like it. Let me explain. Now, the one thing you need to know about Daniel Buddhist Man, if you don't know who he is, is that he's basically a, a troll on YouTube. Now, he's not just any other troll. He has balls, man. <laughs> he has balls. But at the same time, he has every value that troll a troll is. He just wants attention. But the thing is, I don't know why, but some people aren't really realizing that. Uh, I'm pretty sure we all know the fact that he is a troll and that he is just wanting attention. But the reason people like me and other YouTubers who have made videos and continually do that is because we want YouTube to be aware this shouldn't be allowed on that platform. And it shouldn't just be out there. And it shouldn't be able to just make other channels as well. Like, this dude has done some awful things. And I don't think this JFix realises how much he's actually done. It's not just like he's made a few 3M videos like JStation did. JStation was exploiting deaths, still bad enough. This dude has been exploiting deaths, tragedies, uh... He even, on his Discord, on the Foodist Discord thing, which I'm not sure if JFX is aware about, this, they were sharing CP. I'm not going to say what that is, but they were sharing CP throughout the Discord, apparently, and that alone is disgusting, and someone like that shouldn't be allowed on the platform, period. Now, I didn't just come to talk about who this person is. If you don't believe me that this person is just a troll, then, yeah, we're gonna watch a video of his, and, um, yeah, strap in. So let's start off by watching Eight People Are Dead at Astro World Concert. Now, we're gonna be watching this, and if it doesn't come blatantly clear to you that this dude is just a troll, I don't know what is clear to you, dear. Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be going over reasons why all the people at Astro World deserve to die. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck is this? Come on guys, okay. I'm not laughing at what he's talking about here. I'm laughing at the way he's saying it. Like, <laughs> like come on. You can tell this dude is an obvious troll. Like, he doesn't mean anything he's saying. This is just for attention. Like, if you were if you were genuinely trying to say something, would you say it, like, 
So guys, today we're going to be talking about why Adolf Hitler is a very, very, very bad man. Okay, so like and subscribe. Like, would you really talk like that, dude? Come on, you could have made him a bit more believable. If you didn't know, eight people are dead at Astro World because of Travis Scott's um, concert or whatever, and eight people died, which is absolutely hilarious. Those people deserve to die. They are dead for a reason because they got karma for what they did to all those. First of all, they were playing rap music. Second of all, the rap music sucked. And third of all, people who listen to Travis Scott, they all eat cheeseburgers and they're kind of overweight. Like, they're, they're those types of people. And by the way, I'm not making fun of anyone here. I'm just straightening my own facts right now because Travis Scott is one of the worst rappers ever and he's just such a trashy rapper and plus all, all those people were screaming at him while going, trying to get on the stage being like hey stop the concert you guys are so retarded do you really think that black guy's gonna listen to you whoa whoa what the oh okay Daniel calm down there dude calm down if that isn't evident enough that he's racist i'm about to show you clips of multiple times where he said some other racist things roll the clip dude just shut up you fucking you fucking nigger this fucking nigger went out of my way she fucking put so a lot of niggas be hating on my man tenebras dude none of y'all niggas realize well, I'm not saying that in, as in a racist way, but dude, he just wants to make his money and then cash out, you know what I'm talking about. That's the only reason why he was like, um, saying all this bullshit or whatever. See so, you yeah, guys. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of the video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'm gonna be going now and peace. Believe me now, like, I don't get the retards making videos on this dude, like, yeah, he, he says some pretty offensive and dumb shit, but at the same time, it's so fucking obvious that he's a troll and he just wants attention. And by making- Regardless if this guy is trolling or not, this type of content shouldn't be allowed on YouTube. It's exploiting deaths, it's gonna encourage younger people, most likely children, to do the same thing in school and edgy. But I don't think people are taking it in as a whole, the effects this could have on YouTube. You look what happened to Jay Station and stuff. That guy affected the uh, ads as well at the time. It didn't do huge, but it could lead to another ad apocalypse if channels like this remain on YouTube. This guy has said the most blatantly racist and homophobic things. He shared CP on his Discord as well, which is disgusting and illegal. He could be arrested for it. Like, I hope you understand where I'm coming across here. It's just a bit ridiculous trying to claim that just because he's a troll, we shouldn't feed into that. Because how else is YouTube going to be aware of these situations? Because they barely take actions anywhere, especially when it's smaller channels coming to them. Like, YouTube is known for not having much communication with the actual YouTubers. And you could blame YouTube for that, but again, this dude is uploading the videos by his own choice videos on him you're literally just giving him what he wants now i know people are going to be jumping out at me saying like oh but you're making a video on him too well not really for attention i just think that this is a really funny ass person and i'm not really condemning him in any way because i know he isn't really like that like i know there's good in him so um yeah now anyways guys that's probably it for the video right now um yeah peace out your feelings for her are not real. They are real to me! You can sense the good in him. Okay, Luke Skywalker. But on a real, let's just give Daniel Food this man. Actually, do you know what? Let's give his group a benefit of the doubt. Let's give him the benefit of the doubt, saying maybe he's not actually that bad. No. Because something I only found out recently as well makes their whole group even more disturbing. Some of you might have heard of Logan Roof. And obviously he was friends with Daniel Fudisman and Fudisman. He might have been one of the worst ones. I don't really know much about him. I know he commented on one of my videos before. But 
finding out what I know now about what they did is honestly disturbing. What I'm about to show you is a article about Logan Roof apparently being arrested for causing a 12-year-old girl to off herself because of the cyberbullying and whatever they said to her. So after that, it will be at the end of today's video. And yeah, see you guys in a bit. Peace.